Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. May the peace and blessings of Allah be upon you all. I'm Abdullah Oduro and welcome back. When we talk about zakat, we hear zakat more in the month of Ramadan. And as you know, Ramadan is a pillar of Islam. And zakat is a pillar of Islam. So one can be confused. Okay, I hear zakat in the last couple of days of Ramadan, but then I hear zakat as a pillar of Islam that can be paid at any time. The scholars have, have separated or categorized zakat in two in general. There is a zakat of the body and the zakat of the money or the wealth. The zakat that they're referring to in Ramadan is called zakatul fitr. Zakatul fitr. That is the zakat that is given at the end of Ramadan and is given to the poor people. Roughly, it is generally here in America, it is eight to ten dollars. Preferably, if you give the staple food of your locality to any poor individual, any needy person, that is called zakat al fitr. That is where you take a certain amount. And Islamically, it comes to arba'at amdad, which is four handfuls of an amount of food, rice, barley, something staple. Or in, in our time, some scholars even mention taking a meal that is the same value of those four handfuls of food, which is roughly in our time, eight to ten dollars. You give that to the poor. That is the zakat of Ramadan. That is tied to Ramadan, which is obligatory for the Muslim to give. But the pillar of Islam that is zakat that we are talking about is the ones where we where we mention the four categories and you take 2.5% of your surplus wealth if it has reached a certain threshold in time or in amount depending on the item of zakat from the four types that we have talked about. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you with clarity and make you of those upon this clarity work in conjunction with your organizations and always consult your heart to do that what's right. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Thank you.